This episode of Chins and Giggles is brought to you by McDonald's. If you're a listener of our show, you know we just love our McDonald's. We literally eat McNuggets on our episodes. And we've got some iconic news to share with y'all. The McRib is back right now. Here comes the butt. This is the McRib farewell tour. Girl, what? Don't panic though. You guys know how many bands out there have had approximately 12 farewell tours and they keep coming back, right? Well, that's the case with The McRib. It's a farewell tour for now, but you never know if it's gone for good. So go grab yours now. I'm going to go get one right now. Just remember, get some napkins when you pick up your McRib, not just for the barbecue sauce, but to wipe your tears of McRib grief as well. The McRib farewell tour is happening now at McDonald's. Go get yours. Welcome back to Chins and Giggles, episode 35, y'all. You guys, we have two very special guests today. Our very first guest, aside from like friends and family. Well, yeah, we usually, I mean, we've had a family, but like, yeah, I feel like y'all are like official. That doesn't count. count. (laughs) We got Lily and Mondo in the building. What's up? What's up, up, what's up? up? AKA Lily and Bay, AKA Guadis Brand, and AKA The Cruda Realidad. I love your podcast. Yay, Yay, I'm so happy to hear that. that. Dude, I was literally listening it. Listening to it this morning. Oh, yeah, yeah. I am literally like two episodes. I was trying to catch up. <laughs> no, I watch your guys' stuff, but yeah, I was yeah, like, yeah. you know. I yeah. feel like uh, we post a little too much sometimes. <laughs> you so guys are everywhere. I love it. We try, we try. You guys have came out in more podcasts, all right? Yeah. Yes. This yes. is your guys'. This is. She's like 10th. Uh, we're uh, counting. I think it's the third. Like, yeah, yeah. Bigger yeah. platform, let's say. But mm-hmm. we've been yeah. we've been to a couple more. You guys have yeah, done yeah. a few for real. I mean, for us, you're our first guest. You guys so, are yeah. like our first. I'm like, we got to ask the right questions, girl. Not yeah. looking stupid out here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you guys watch our podcast, but me and Karina are a mess. Like, we No, no. I are, watch it all girl. the time. Yes. I love know. it, though. Always oh, giggling. Always laughing. Crying. Crying. Everything. The tears. All the yeah, tears yeah. of it. All <laughs> but we did write, like, our notes down, y'all, because we're a fucking hot mess. So if y'all see me on my phone, she's no trying to stay organized. Yeah, you're not on TikTok, are you? Just, you're right, no right. She's working. It. <laughs> um, so tell us a little bit about what you guys do, all that good stuff. Okay, I'll go first. In a nutshell. Um, so we started with a brand. You know, uh, we, we opened up our brand in 2017. And soon after that, um, we started trying to grow our personal platform. So now we're in the influencer world. Um, we did open up another business too. We have, we got into YouTube and podcasts. So Mm -hmm. we do a little bit of everything right now. We've been, we've been running and, and taking as much as we can as we go. Like podcasts, YouTube. TikTok, whatever pops up yeah pops do it all. It what it. don't yeah. you guys like not do you guys do everything sleep sleep like, yeah. period <laughs> that part like I, I was I was thinking about it the other day um cause I'm a morning person right so I wake mm. up around 6 uh 5.30 oh a.m. yes so she falls yeah. asleep around 4 5 me yeah. so, yeah. I literally too so Lily and Bay, if you put us together like a one team we're, we're up 24 hours god literally, damn like, I literally it'll be 4 o'clock in the morning and I'm like Shit, Mando's gonna wake up in an hour or two. Let me go to that sleep. That is so funny. And, yeah. and and this time change right now. I'm waking up at three a.m. here in the LA. I like yeah. I went to sleep two hours away. I'm like shit. So when uh-uh. I get back to to Tampa, yeah. hopefully uh, the schedule's I'm not gonna be all yeah, yeah. Up. <laughs> You oh guys have God. been here all week too, huh? Yeah, we got here on Tuesday, right? Tuesday, yeah, literally a whole week. But. We were in Houston before that. Yeah, we flew from Houston over <laughs> so here. You guys yeah. haven't been home in a minute. Yeah. Like two weeks. I'm yeah. ready to go home tonight. <laughs> yeah, we're ready. Is this the longest like trip you guys have done or is it usually um, like this? I think, I think so. it's the longest influencer like event trip Work. in a while. Work, oh. yeah. Two I mean, yeah. there was a lot going on. We had Big Bear. Yeah. Then we had the Murillo party. Yeah. The launch party. Then we had Beauty Birds party. It was a lot. I feel like I've seen you guys literally every, every single day. day. Every day. Every day. Literally. Gassi, Except Gassi, yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we almost saw each other yeah. yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was going to go yesterday because we were all going to go to dinner. Yeah. And I did regret it once I was seeing the stories of it. I know. Bomb. It was bomb, girl. Mr. Chow, yeah. girl. I was like, damn, I wanted to go. But I was like, it's too much. Like, I'm so behind on everything. I was it's like, been girl, a crazy week. Yeah. yeah, we had to clean the house. I, I was like, girl. Right. Yeah. And you were telling me that you get homesick, right? I do, girl. girl I how mean, do y'all do it? I um, I, I, there was a point, and actually, it was very recent where it was starting to become very draining, like uh-huh. the um, traveling, and people were probably like, "What?" Like mm-hmm. rolling their eyes, like this bitch, right? But no, because it's <laughs> at the end of the day, it's work. 
Uh-huh. So there was a point where it was becoming very draining until I had like a little wake up call. And I was like, bro, we got to take advantage of the moment because some people wish Period. they could That's do true. stuff like this. You know, so it. why why am I going to go to this event with like a draining yeah. um, or like not positive attitude? Yeah. So now I just kind of flipped the switch and now I'm like, that, let's yeah. go. Period. YOLO. I'd be, be like, babe, yeah. you're excited. And she like switches. Like, yeah. yeah She's like, excited. I don't yeah. know. Like, you know what? Let's do this. We get to before we get to, like when we first first met, you know. Um, when you go on a trip, like we get to the airport and we're like ready to drink. Let's get some mimosas. Like, let's get this party started. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But then for the past, like maybe year, year yeah. we get to the airport and we're like, we're just trying to get, we're just gonna, <laughs> trying to get on the flight to go to sleep, you know? Yeah. Yeah. But now we kind of went backwards again and it's like, okay, we're at the airport. Let's get a mimosa. Let's get a beer. Let's do something just to try to get like, yeah. feel like we're on vacation, even get though, the spirit. Yeah. yeah, even though it's like a work trip, it's not really hard work. You guys know mm-hmm. that, you know, we did a meet and greet. That's fun. You know, oh we went God, to all these that events. That was for Houston, right? That's yeah, Houston, yeah. yeah. So how did that go? Oh my God. It was crazy. Yeah, it was Houston insane. shows wow. so much love every time we go. Damn. And I was a little worried girl because we did it last year in mm-hmm. Houston también, last minute. And I was like, cuando me ofrecieron to do it this year, I was mm-hmm. like, shit, you know, we're not that big. So, Everybody from Houston already saw us last right, year. They're right. not going to go again, you know? But no, it was crazy. It was lit. Yeah, it was Iconic. lit. I was worried, too, because um, the organizer of the event, mm-hmm. she put a oh, lot of yeah. effort, a lot of money into it. Yeah. So for it to tank or not go as good as we thought well, it would. Well, you guys yeah. are popping. I mean, you know? I was about yeah. to say, I'm like, y'all are pretty up there, like, yeah. Well, period. Well, we always, like, um, we see it because when we meet people, we're like, damn, like, we can't believe it, you know? But... We, when we're hanging out with people like you guys, we're, we're, we know we're not there yet, you know? So, oh, my God. No, yeah. stop. No, you guys stop. are fucking icons. <laughs> if anything, I bitch, like... I was nervous. I was like, no oh, my way. God. We're doing the podcast with them. I was no like, way. fangirling. Because I, I watch you guys, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank um, you, thank you. But, yeah, I mean, I see you guys. Like, y'all are that it couple for sure. I guess it hasn't hit us. I swear yeah, to yeah. God. At least it hasn't hit me. No. Like, and, uh-huh. go ahead, go ahead. and when I meet everybody, too, like... You guys are all so nice and so genuine and friendly oh, that you. people might think like, you know, when you meet like your, you know, like your celebrity crush, your idols or anybody, um, people might think like, damn, they might be like rude or whatever. But no, you guys make it seem like you guys are, well, you are down to earth and <laughs> normal people, you know, so it makes us feel super I could welcome, say the same know? thing about you guys. Yeah. I was telling Myra how you guys are so like easy to welcome gravitate me. to. Yeah. Because... I don't know if you guys have had, like, and you guys haven't had any, like, weird experiences in the influencer world. Not yet. Where yeah. Where you, like, meet somebody and you're, like, a little oh, like, off. you're, like, intimidated almost because, like, they don't look approachable. I feel like yeah, I see yeah, people yeah. like that. Where mm-hmm. I'm, like, I'm, like, I fucking love watching you and stuff. But, like, oh, you scared me a little bit. Like, they're cool and all, but you know what I mean? Like, so yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah, I see what you're saying. You say. know what I mean? Every time you see them, like, you, it's hard to, like, fully click. Does that make no, sense? No, yeah, yeah. For, sure, like, for sure. Should I tell them? What? Spell it. Tell yeah, right. us. So, tell us. So, um, like, Sebas. what is he about to say? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're, you're like, shh. <laughs> so, so with Sebas, I mean, I look up to his podcast, uh-huh. everything he does oh, yeah. and everything, right? That's really cool. And um, the last three times that I met him, I was like, you're saying, like, I shouldn't go up to him or nothing like that. Oh, you know? Yeah. Like, like, you were, like, nervous? It's, it, it was, it's scary. Yeah, you know, I get it. Even after we did the podcast. Even after. Yeah. yeah. And but he's so like cool, he's so like yeah. welcoming and oh, everything. Yeah. But yeah. I yeah. still had that, you know. Yeah. And then this last, this last yeah, time. Yeah. So yeah, go ahead, go we ahead. we saw him at the twins party, right? And Mando on a normal day, he'll go up to all the guys. Hey, what's up? How are you doing? And, you know, like t- ready to party. But with Sebas, and Sebas was like, you know, somebody he looked up to, you know, oh, with everything. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Um, he was more intimidated. Okay. So I saw Mondo kind of just waiting like, around, the time, yeah. you know, Dude, I'm until like it like, too, I'm like that too. came naturally. And when I saw that the next day, I'm like, babe, don't be like that. Just be yourself. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, you yeah. know, Yeah, I know what you mean though. Like, you I know, they're it. cool and stuff, but you get almost like a little shy. You're like, yes. Hey, you know, yes. Like, so, so then at beauty birds event, you saw it. Like, yeah. Right. When I saw him, I punched him. I said, what's up? <laughs> yeah. Literally, 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 I literally, literally, I literally, that, because you know? él, él se lleva así. You guys see him on his podcast with Josh. Siempre his están llevando mm-hmm. y mando se lleva con todos like yeah. sometimes I'd be like bait <laughs> down. Down because <laughs> you never know but when I when I made him realize that yeah it was a whole nother mando uh-huh. uh, at yeah, the beauty right. birds I know yeah. I'm like that too though like if I look up to someone a lot like I get like I don't know like it's not that I'm nervous I, it, yeah. I just don't want to be like in Simosa and you yeah. know you're oh, not yeah, for yeah. Sure. Yeah, 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 like, sure. like you know that they don't mind but you're like oh I don't want to be like fangirling and stuff. Yeah, I yeah. feel like that all the time. Yeah. I get that for sure. No, yeah. yeah. I've had some awkward moments too. But not like bad, but I'm like the same way yeah. where I'm like, 
do they do they forget I about me? Feel like, like I struggle like, with that. Should shit. I go up and they're gonna be like, "Who are you?" Like, I I do yeah. feel like that. I feel like sure. I'm like that at a lot of events because I'm like, I don't want to be like bugging nobody oh, and shit. No. So I'm just fucking standing yeah. there like, no, no, no. And, <laughs> yeah. And this one over here, she don't give a fuck. Yeah, I'm She's gonna go up. You're like a social butterfly. Yeah, yeah. I'd be like, hey. Yeah. I'll, I'll tell them straight like oh my god I love you so much you know you're I so cool that. you know but yeah, you guys both give that. me those vibes you guys yeah. are very out there for sure yeah. oh yeah, yeah both yeah. social yeah yeah oh, Mando, you would that. you would <laughs> you would think I'm a social butterfly but um on camera definitely right uh-huh. definitely but to meet strangers Mm-hmm. Mando no se cae no psico, bro. Like I he's did. he's that guy in the elevator making small talk yeah. with yeah, people, I'm you here know. For it. That's <laughs> yeah. good. That's good. Yeah, and I was a complete opposite. Like I would never, you know, just uh-huh. get on the elevator and be on my phone, wait till I get mm-hmm. off, you know. But that's now good. I feel like I've opened up more because of him. I yeah. mean, that's good though to have like social skills because you guys are meeting. I'm sure like fans all the time and yeah, stuff. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then going to events too. You want to oh, be yeah. social. You guys are very big like social butterflies. Sure. Yeah. yeah, I love that. Yeah. So it's like the influencer world what you guys expected like is it what yeah i think know? it's better i think it's yeah. better because on online unfortunately you get a lot of those negative people like oh my yeah. god influencers don't fuck with them whatever right <laughs> yeah. but you know you if you've never hung out with them partied with them vied with them we were together what three three days at big bear yeah. um yeah mm-hmm. if you if you've never been in that situation or mm-hmm. you know met them like that then you shouldn't talk because you just don't know yet, yeah, yeah. you know. But al contrario, everybody's super nice. Um, mm-hmm. We've never had um, any problems. So, yeah, I think yeah. Every, it's way better than what I thought it was going to be for yeah, sure. Yeah, and I think yeah. the cool thing, too, is that we now we have friends in the industry. Mm-hmm. So, we get, you know, you get You along. get more comfortable, too. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah for sure. We get invited to, you know, parties, to events, traveling, you know. So, it's... It's mm-hmm. fun, yeah. We forgot to mention you guys, but we do have Brian and Ro in the building too. <laughs> Why the fuck did I forget <laughs> to say? I that? know, I know. We're literally just paying attention. Yeah, <laughs> they're here. They have a mic. <laughs> they got a mic just in case, you know, but yeah. just to chime in a little bit. Yeah. So because, you guys. Are, oh, sorry. Go ahead. I was gonna say yeah because those guys at Key they were getting lit th- these past yeah. few days. <laughs> they definitely click. Yeah. yeah. All we've been doing for this past six days is drinking. Y'all yeah, been just drinking and drinking. Yeah. Oh my god. It's I don't know. a lot. It's okay, so lot. you guys are like known to like you know party it up, mm-hmm, party mm-hmm. party animal energy. Um. So. You told me you were a homebody, right? Yeah. Like, how sure. are you guys? Is this is this something you guys do like you know a lot, or is it more just like <laughs> when you guys travel, like like the party? What's a day in a life with y'all? No, no. On a normal day when we're in Florida, we are normal working week. every day. We, <laughs> we go to the warehouse every day, like a nine I'm to five. Sure. We get up, we go to the gym, we don't drink, um, we eat healthy while we're yeah. at home. Period. Yeah, but we do all that because we know we have so many events and parties mm-hmm. and we're fucking down, you know? Mm-hmm. So I'm like, we have to have some kind of balance. So while we're at home, no, unless it's like a friend's birthday or, you know, an, an event back, ho- back home, uh-huh. mm-hmm. then we will go, you know, but not even then do I drink, yeah, right? Be yeah, chilling. I'd be like chilling yeah. um unless it's something that you know we've been planning for a while you know and then we get like hyped about it party. oh yeah like my halloween party yeah, girl i blacked lit. out yeah <laughs> i blacked, out. blacked as out as you should as you <laughs> yeah. should so, yeah. so that's a good question because um my mom out of oh my everyone, god she one day i would say sat me down and said hijo ya ya parale oh my god. god i was like yeah yeah bájale. i'm like day, what, what, so you're the party on? animal no, wait. And, and she's like, ya bájale. I was like, what are you talking about? He's like, siempre estás tomando. But all she sees is is these videos. Yeah. Or, I get you know, because yeah. she lives three hours away, you know? Mm-hmm. So she don't see me on a daily. Mm, so she okay. sees me posting like old videos of me drinking or yeah. because that's kind of what we, the content and, that we push yeah. out. And she's watching our vlogs and all our vlogs are like lit. You yeah, know? yeah. So, all the events so, and stuff. So I'm yeah. like, look, mom, like, you know, I do this. For the camera sometimes, you know, yeah. Uh, yeah. or re- when we record and whatnot, we, we mm-hmm. post it and yeah. that's what I'm posting. But just because I'm posting it every day or whatnot doesn't mean that that's what I do on a daily, you know? Yeah. yeah. So then after that, she understood, you know, I was like, oh, okay, cool, yeah, yeah. cool. So we know, just keep a good communication. He's like, mom, I'm not going to post when I'm driving to work yeah. on YouTube. And when yeah. I'm, you know, at the warehouse, I'll post mm-hmm. when I have an event. So at the events, obviously we're drinking and hanging out, you yeah, know? Of course. So I, I guess so the, tough, the tough part is that when we do like, for example, a meet and greet, everyone shows up with bottles. Yo. Everyone wants to take a shot with you. I could you see that. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. So it's stuff. like, oh, you know, I start spinning. 
the shots out over here. <laughs> Dude. Oh yeah. No, yeah, because people see you guys and they think like party animals. Yeah, you know? yeah. And especially when you're traveling out here to LA, yeah. you guys are going to these events. Like, how do you not drink? It, like, whenever I go to an event out here, I'm like, oh, like, I might not drink today. Like, how the fuck and do you, you can't? still end up drinking? Yeah, and then no. you end up getting drunk. Like, yeah. it's so hard not to. Yeah. Because you just want to socialize too and everyone's drinking. Like, it's almost impossible to not drink at these events for real. Yeah. Yeah, we, I don't mind that. I'm down. Because <laughs> like I said, once I get back home, it's like lame Lily Bay again. So <laughs> while I'm out here, like I'm down. Yeah. Time, sure. oh, yeah. yeah so yeah, talking down. about your brand, um, tell us a little bit how you guys got started. You guys started that before your channel, right? Oh, that yeah. That was like the before. first thing yeah, you guys yeah. did. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, one day we were just sitting at home and um, I had just graduated from college. And I went to college for business and we were just like talking about like, okay, what's the next step? What should we do? Mando had just moved to Tampa with me. Um, his career um, was in Miami. So when he moved to Tampa, like we both started from like scratch. Yeah. Like he 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 was able, um, fortunately, to get work in Tampa. The same thing that he kind of did in Miami, mm -hmm. but it wasn't as consistent because he, he was a land. A, what do you call audio it? Audio engineer. He was a freelancing audio engineer. Yeah. Oh, cool. So they would call him up randomly for jobs. So it wasn't like a Monday through Friday. You mm -hmm. know. So we we're like, okay, what should we do? I already graduated. You know, we, we, I graduated for business. So I knew I wanted to open a business, mm -hmm. but I wasn't really sure what we had a few things in mind that we had previously talked about. And some of them required hundreds of thousands of dollars to start. It was like, um, I wanted kind of like a Gulichi town in Florida. Cause we don't have oh, okay. that, oh, shit, you know? Cool. So to do that, bitch, the kitchen, mm -hmm. all that is like the decorations, yeah. the booths, all that. It was going to be way, yeah. yeah. So we didn't have the money. So we we're like, okay, let's think about something else. And we had already talked about Guadis because previously, you want to tell them? Yeah. One of my fifth or sixth failed businesses was Guadis. Yeah. So I started Guadis okay. maybe two years before I met her. Oh, but, yeah. okay. What? Right, right, right. So bought oh, some guaraches. I was like, you know what? I'm going to take these back to the U.S. because I bought them in Mexico. Uh -huh. And I'm going to sell these. And they sat there. The name was done. Guadis brand wow. was there. So, so then. Yeah, but. He never sold a pair. Yeah, so when we started pair. dating, I went to his house and I saw a big ass box and I'm like, what is this? Thinking it's like ex-girlfriend photos. <laughs> <laughs> so um, it, I opened it up and it was a whole bunch of huaraches because that's what we started Guadis yeah. with. And I was like, what is this? And he told me and I was like, ah, I could sell them for you. Like, Dude, I didn't yeah. know that. Yeah. yeah. So I just wore them a few times, posted it on my story. I didn't have a big following, but I did have a very loyal following. I probably mm -hmm. had like... Not even 10,000, you know? Facebook, right? On Facebook, right? No, yeah, 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 yeah Facebook. Facebook and Instagram, the beginning mm -hmm. of Instagram. Bigger okay. on Facebook. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. So I posted them, and right away we sold all of them. So wow. whenever, a few months later, we talked about it, he was like, okay, so what if we do Guadis? And I'm like, you know what? All right, let's do it, you know? And we just, um, we went to Mexico. We sourced, like, where to get huaraches and how to yeah, actually so cool. make them well, better. Don't you know? skip the most interesting part. <laughs> we, we flew into to Jalisco, right? To Guadalajara. We drove through the mountains of Michoacan looking Whoa, for yeah. these places, That's these so factories. Cool. Yeah. Oh my By God. ourselves. Dangerous as hell. Yeah. And what's crazy <gasps> is because they told us that the sort that where they make them make them, it was in Michoacan. Yeah. So we're like, okay, fuck it, let's go, right? Yo, as soon as we cross into Michoacan, there was a, a reten, reten oh, right there with scary. their big matralletas yeah. and stuff. And we looked at each other like, oh my God, take off the Gucci shade. Take <laughs> no, off the oh my God. Pretend that I'm oh sleeping. God. You know, it really be like that out there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Just in case, you know, even though we've always been the type driving around Mexico, como si no pasa nada. Yeah. Um, that time. That was a new territory. Yeah, we were yeah. like, mm. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. So, I'm curious because I know like with every business, there's always someone that like wears the pants. Who's like the one that's like in charge? Like it's my way, you know. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I that's mean, yeah. Period, yeah, queen. For sure. So it's Lily's way. Uh, right well, at the me... beginning, yeah, we, I was trying to take that role. And Definitely. Y la estaba cagando. Like I'll, I'll mess things up. Or... She's like until I sold the sandals. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Even after we started, started yeah. like well, you know, 2017. Once we relaunched, yeah. Um, yeah, he tried to yeah. take the role, and I gave it to him because yeah, he he did the name and everything, you know. Um, but yeah, he he kept fucking up yeah. so much. Okay. Nos llegaban cosas that were misspelled. Nos llegaban yeah. like there was just <laughs> no, so much. Oh my god! Yeah. So creative wise, like you're. Yeah, oh yeah, creative. for sure, for sure. That's cool. And he's he's more of like the behind the scenes, like editing, you know, um, okay. pictures, photos, payments, posting, payments. Yeah, yeah. teamwork. 
Yeah. Yeah. The, yeah. And Period. the fact that y'all were out there in Mexico too, like sourcing it like that, that's yeah. really cool. Yeah. Because, yeah. you know, so there's people that could just like order them in bulk. And, oh, you know, no, no. the fact that you guys are like hands on going yeah. to Mexico well, is cool. And then we pull up to these, um, what do you call it, little factories. Mm-hmm. And these guys are like slammed. They say, it's like, no, we can't take more. We're good. We don't need new clients and things oh, like that. No way. Yeah. Because we were literally knocking on people's doors, yeah. you know, every, like that in a little town that make guaraches. Dude, that's so cool. And everybody was saying no. Like we we told them, um, hey, you know, like everybody, we try to sell them like our story. Like we want to start this brand, you know, but we want to source better leather leathers because we're from Guanajuato and Guanajuato is known for le- for leather. Mm-hmm. Oh. And um, we're like, yeah, we could get you guys better leather for our shoes and pay you guys more, you know, because um, at the end of the day, we want to help them grow, too, you know, and if yeah. they're happy, we're happy. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Yo, everybody would be like, no, 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 estamos, estamos muy saturados, estamos muy saturados. Yeah, That's saturado. the word that they told us. And I would be like, bro, because I would walk into their casitas like bien humildes, and I would be like, how are you so busy, pero todavía, you know, in my head, yeah, right? Yeah. And I wanted them, you they know, missed out. to, you know, until we found somebody. He was actually Chicano living out there. So when we told him, he was down. He was like, let's do it. He's like, I've been trying to save money to go back to Chicago um, and we were like, okay, let's do it, let's do it. Yo, in less than three months, he made enough with us to um, basically move back to Chicago. Yeah, dude, dipped on yeah. us. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Dipped on us, man. Was, yeah. It was oh good God. business for yeah. him, huh? But he didn't, he didn't leave us, no. like, um, in the, you know, how do you say it, in the dark. He left us with his suegro. His, he was actually working with oh, his suegro. Okay. Yeah. So he just he explained to his suegro, look, you know, um, you can start working with them. They're going to pay you more, mm-hmm. you know. And if you need anything fixed in the little warehouse that they were at, like, just tell them and they'll fix it. Because, for example, I'll give you a little example. Mm-hmm. Um, when we got to their warehouse, um, it was their like, house. It was a house, not a warehouse. About yeah. This, huh? yeah, never, never. <laughs> I love it. I love yeah. it. Yeah, never I like this. I love it. Yeah, when we got to their little area where they make the huaraches, the leather that they would use was always on the floor. Mm-hmm. And the floor is like concrete, dirt, you know, whatever. Mm-hmm. So they make the, the leather, they make like a little strip for the huaraches. And sometimes oh. they look dirty because they've been on the floor. Mm-hmm. Like they like pull mm-hmm. them around and stuff. So I would just give them little ideas like, hey, you know, can I buy you guys like shelving and stuff, yeah, you that's know? Cool. Wow. Yeah, so we can like, well, at the end of the day, so the huaracha leather doesn't get dirty and it doesn't, mm-hmm. I wouldn't tell them like that, you know? Yeah. But, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, so just little things like that, better lighting, just, I would offer them, you know? Oh, that's that way cool, they kind of you were saw. like helping out their business yeah, in yeah, general yeah, with yeah. just being partners, but then on top of that, like helping out with yeah. tips Yeah, because they weren't only doing our huarachas, they were doing everyone else's, but mm-hmm. we well, kind of But we went busy, through so know? much, you know what else? Um... We sourced leathers from Guanajuato, better leathers. And um, um, at one point, we came to like a little halt because they didn't want to source leather from Guanajuato because there was like, um, was it a narco or what was it? Yeah. Oh my God. Like oh, that shit. they oh, didn't shit. allow them to buy from outside of Michoacan. Like they had Whoa. to own. They had yeah. to buy from that one guy. Yeah. And we didn't know that. We yeah. had no idea. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, crazy. so it was like little shit That's like that, scary, and we were like, lucky. "What the fuck?" <laughs> Do you yeah, still yeah. um, go out there to? Actually, find... we haven't gone in a very long time. Okay, um, but yeah, we we did go a few times after that. Um, yeah, yeah, we probably but, haven't been there like well a year, since COVID. Two years? When yeah, COVID, since COVID happened, mm-hmm. yeah, we like stopped and we haven't gone since. Yeah, yeah. How mm-hmm. So who? Oh, go ahead. Sorry, <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> no. I was just gonna say, like, when did this start? Like, when did the brand start? Um, it started in like five years ago, August right? of 2017. Oh my god, five yeah. years already? Yeah. yeah. Damn, years. that's cool. Mm-hmm. It's been you a while. You came up with a name, right? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. How did it come about? So at the time, um, Guaraches, G-U-A, was for Guaraches. Yeah. And then... Uh, no. We... G-U-H. Oh, 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 yeah the g-u-a is from guanajuato because uh-huh. that's right, where we're right, from right. that's how you spell guanajuato oh, g-u-a yeah. and the r-i-z we just pulled letters from guarachitos oh, um yeah. and we just got the r the i but then instead of an s we put a z just to make it like look like a vibe you know and cool. yeah. Yeah. it's just a mashup of words it's a good yeah. name I love it. too mm-hmm. it's catchy mm-hmm. yeah we and when he told it when he told me about it i was like yes because i didn't want a name um, I don't know. I wanted like a made up name, kind of mm-hmm. like at the mm-hmm. time I thought Nike is not like you can't use Nike in a sentence unless you're talking yeah, about yeah. Nikes, you know. Yeah, um, so I wanted like a re- like a made up name. But then mm-hmm. we later on found out that it was oh Guadis is actually a little city somewhere in Ose Donde. In France like, or some shit. Yeah. Like, really? Yeah. 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 Like one day we're going to go there and take a <laughs> picture in Guadis. That is hilarious. Yeah. 
So who designs like the shirts and stuff? Ah, uh, me. Yeah. You everything. design everything? Everything. Oh my what god. Yeah. You guys, fuck? if you're watching the visuals, we actually all have the brand on. Yeah. Yeah. Back there oh too. My god. <laughs> right? Dude, right? I didn't know you designed it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Dang, oh, so shit. y'all are like I'm sorry, I'm all yeah. someone talking. I'm like, oh, I'm all it's hard to get guys because of the earphones. Sorry, yeah. I'm all cutting everyone off. <laughs> no, but that's so impressive. Like yeah. you guys are really like running this shit like fully. Oh, like yeah. So that's that's what brings up that yeah. subject that she talked about earlier. Like we just mm-hmm. gotta expand our team and to push this, you know, in a bigger scale, you know? Yeah, because for I wanna mm-hmm. say the past two years, I feel like we've kind of been on a little halt because mm-hmm. we've been so busy not only with Guadis, but now we have YouTube, the influencer mm-hmm. live and now podcast and everything Damn. so for a while we were like very unorganized so there was a time where i wasn't designing nothing or doing anything because we were so busy mm-hmm. you know um but we finally got like a little schedule that we try to stick to and it's been working out for us and now seeing like everybody that has teams and stuff we're like yo we need a bigger team for, for sure, sure. Yeah. Do you guys wanna... have a team for the brand um, right now we do have um some girls that work at the warehouse oh, okay. they ship uh, we have our manager there she takes care of everything customer service, um, customer service. we Amazing. also have our photographer that we work with um i also have some people that i work with artists like to draw me up whatever i need sometimes when wow. you know yeah um and even then whenever i at one point i was looking for a team the way i did it was i posted it on guadis and i was like you know what i want to give our raza um the potential yeah. to possibly work with us I so i like that. outsourced artists models content creators oh, that's so cool you know and I, like at, and still to this day i work with at least five different people yeah, that models, so cool creator, yeah. that yeah. we pay and stuff i you give know? you guys mm-hmm. props because i see guadis as such like an established like big brand yeah thank like you, just you. hearing how involved you guys are like going to mexico to source everything yeah. like yeah. You're, you're designing everything like yeah. damn yeah. mad props yeah. to yeah. you guys dude thank you. Thank I would have never so known. Much going on yeah. too. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah. How do you guys do it? Like, I don't know, girl. Don't know, and then man. you guys were saying how you guys edit your guys' own podcast. Oh, oh my god, that alone dude, is like oh my so god. difficult. And, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. well. <laughs> Um, I don't do the editing. Mando yeah. does the editing. So, and recently, we um we have the photographer who helps us out with like chopping things up, syncing things uh-huh. up together. So yeah. shout okay. out to Romy. He helps it out a lot. The so. syncing yeah, yeah. is a the syncing huh? is the angles too. Like it's all of it. <laughs> Yeah. These yeah. fucking flies, y'all. <laughs> Girl. There's flies I'm everywhere. So sorry, y'all. <laughs> who, left, who left the door open? Like, what is going on? No, and we actually had to clean up the room because... <laughs> Girl, Dude. this room be getting a little crazy. No, I was like, this real. is embarrassing. There's times like in the morning where they like they'll pull up, and I'm like so embarrassed because like the darks came in here, they fucking shot everywhere. I'm like, <laughs> no, yeah, no, like, dude, it gets bad in here. No, sometimes. we understand yeah. now. We it's cleaned only... up just for young. Oh, it looks fine. They're excited on the. She's way. like, it's dirty as fuck in here. She's like, it still smells. <laughs> You should go into our podcast room right now. It's oh like my Halloween God. decorations. Like, yeah, you can't yeah. even walk in there. I yeah. feel like we're all the same, like with content creating. Yeah. Like behind the camera, everything looks good. Mess. And then, like across the camera, it's oh, like yeah. a fucking disaster. There's a hurricane over there. Do you guys have pets? Uh, no, not yet. Oh, we're actually okay. going to get one. I yes. really do want uh, a puppy, but I feel oh. bad that we're always uh, never yeah. home, I mean. Oh, that's yeah. true. So um, up until recently, my brother and my sister were like, just get one and we'll help you, you know? And they love dogs, too. So I'm like, yay! Yeah. And actually, we were going to take one today. Um, oh, what the fuck yeah. today? Um, we, we had, Mando had posted me playing with a little puppy and, um, two people reached out to him and they were like, Hey, tell her that we'll give her a puppy from our litter. They were like Frenchies. And I was like, don't play with me. They're like, yeah, whenever you come to LA. So I was so excited. We get here Mm -hmm. today. Well, we've been here, right? Yeah. And de repente me, me dicen, oh, you know what? No, I'm sorry. Um, we're too attached yeah, now. Yeah, it's family. Like, oh. The dog is family now. Yeah. Like, I respect that, you know? No, watch, yeah, after no, this, okay, everyone's okay. going to be like, I have some dogs for you. <laughs> no. Everybody's going to be like, yeah. Go yes. back home with like 10 dogs. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh I do want dogs. What was that? I know it's her. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, so when did you guys start your guys' channel? Mm, yeah, like started, when That was recent, right? It's going to be three years. Um, in February, so next year will be three years. Right, yeah, right, right. so two and a half years, let's say. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's funny because I discovered. Um, I know about the the. I always say it wrong. Wadi's Wadi's brand. Uh-huh. Um, I found out about it through Brian. Me too. I think you guys had sent him something. Oh yeah, yeah, the, yeah. the Mood T-shirt, right? Mood? So was it? Yeah, it was that one. Yeah. 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 Oh, see, see. And then 
uh, uh, Durango, yeah, Durango green t-shirt. Yeah, Durango, yeah. Pop, no? oh, okay. So I knew about the brand, but I remember when I was like in my, um, I don't know if you guys had like a Grupo Firme concert that you guys went to. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. You guys yeah. did a vlog, right? right yes. Right, right. This was like in my Grupo Firme, like era bitch. I was like <laughs> obsessed with them. We were going yeah. to a concert. So I was like on YouTube mm -hmm. and I found your guys' video. I'm like, oh my God, who's this couple? Because like <laughs> the way you guys edit is fucking iconic. Jeez. Um, you guys good, yeah. So I knew about the brand, but I also knew about you guys, but I didn't know you guys were the owners. Oh, yeah. oh. Oh, okay, okay. So I love that you guys like stand on your own. Does that make sense? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. The brand yeah. stands on its own. You guys yeah. stand on its own. It's like, That's but the... I didn't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know when I found out. I don't know if it was when we met you guys mm -hmm. that you told us. Oh yeah, I'm I did sure. at the Aguilar's event. We met at the Aguilar's yeah. event. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that's when I found out. I think that you guys were the no, owners. No, but for real, right? for real, nah, like dead ass. Like, what happened? Oh, like, now nah, you just don't listen to me. I'm, <laughs> I was gonna I'm say, dead. though, like, Brian is always wearing your guys' always. stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Like, that's Sheesh. literally his wordrobe. Like, right, we're dead gonna ass. No more. Yeah. That's yeah. how I discovered you guys, too, because yeah. Brian, like, I would compliment his stuff, like, the mood one. Yeah, yeah. That yeah, one's yeah. so iconic. <laughs> yeah. And, like, yeah, like, he's literally always wearing your guys' stuff. And you guys have established yourselves as, like, yeah. you know, as content creators, because mm -hmm. there's times I'm like, oh my God, that's right. I have a buddy. He's like, mm hmm. And it's good because, you know, yeah. like, you guys are already like like everything's established like your podcast like you as mm -hmm, creators mm -hmm. and then the brand like everything's just like yeah. it's hustling. amazing I, I, you guys are doing amazing I honestly Thank you. feel like we're still like planting seeds you know like period like, seeing the growth you're like we're just, getting so, yeah. we're just getting started <laughs> I love it I love it <laughs> and you guys are out here a lot have yeah. you guys considered moving out here that's the number one question <laughs> yeah right? we get that all the time mm -hmm. and Honestly, me, I've always said no. No, not because I don't like L.A. I uh -huh. do like, like L.A. And I wouldn't be here all the time. But I'm super close to my family like you guys. And I couldn't yeah. see myself leave my niece and my nephews. Mm -hmm. I would cry all the time. So, Are you yeah. guys from there? Uh, like, Florida? Were you born there? Uh, yeah. Well, actually, I was born here in Cali. I was born uh -huh. in San Jose. Oh. But oh, my parents moved back to Florida when I was two. So oh. She was here for like two minutes. Literally. Okay. Two yeah. minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Literally. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh my. Okay. Yeah, I've been there my but, whole life. Florida. But um, as far as moving, I'm down. Yeah, I'm down. Yeah. You know, try down. it out for two or three years, see what happens, and if, uh -huh. if not, we'll go back. But would you do LA? I don't know. LA is just crazy. It's crazy, though. yeah. It's a lot. Maybe it's yeah. some a little outside of LA. Yeah, but yeah. I mean, well, every yeah. time we go to like we come, well, that now that we've came here, the twins' house, other twins' house. I mean, yeah. mm -hmm. and all my other friends that live on the outskirts, I really like it. Mm -hmm. It's um, it's still, it's not like the middle of nowhere how people make yeah. it seem. There's still a lot going on. Mm -hmm. Like, you guys have everything. Um, mm -hmm. So that, if I were to ever move, I would probably be, like, be like that, out here. you know? Yeah, yeah like for sure. And then LA, sure. too. Like, I feel like it's just too crazy. Like, I mean, we're out here in Cali because we were born here and shit. But I could understand, like, having that pressure of, you know, everyone Moving. telling you to move. Because everything's out here, you know? Yeah, yeah. Like, us, like, we were just, like, born here. So we're like, I'm like, oh, I'm glad we're out here. Yeah, but we're like just like an eat. hour away, you know. Everything's like an hour away and shit. Yeah. But I felt the pressure before too, like to like take the well, move you to lived, LA, LA. You lived in LA. Oh at yeah. Some point. I had an apartment out there because I used to be out there a lot for meetings, and the traffic was like crazy. So mm -hmm. I remember I was like, let's just get an apartment out there just because we were there so much. But that was only like two years. Yeah. And then after that, I was like, dude, like first of all, it's too fast. Even like a. Just like an apartment, like not even a thousand square feet, like fucking like four K. Like they're crazy. Yeah, yeah. So mm -hmm. expensive and I guess I guess the cool thing about us not living in LA or California is that we bring something else. Like we yeah. bring a different vibe, a different Florida oh, vibe. Oh yeah. Like that. People yeah. are always shook when we tell them we're not from here because they think we are, you know? Yeah. Until in conversation we're like, No, we just flew in from Florida and they're like what the hell are you doing in Florida? How There's did you Mexicans get over there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just thinking that. I, you know what? I, I was like, how do I bring that up? I was yeah. thinking that too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So where are you guys from in Mexico? You guys are both Mexican, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, well, I'm from Guanajuato. And my well, my, my dad's from Guanajuato. My mom's from El Estado of Mexico. Yeah, same Guanajuato. And oh, what, okay. what's wow. funny is when we met, he lived in Miami and I live in Tampa. Four hours away, right? Oh, shit. But when we found out where we were from in Mexico, it's 20 minutes away from each other. Yeah, that's crazy. So, I want to know yeah. about that. Yeah. Snapchat, right? You guys oh, yeah, Snapchat? yeah. Yeah, it went did. down in the DM literally. <laughs> mm -hmm. How did who did the first move? Mando. I did. Um, I did small talk. I didn't say like uh, how though. Like how did you guys meet on like on Snapchat? Um, so like he said earlier, my Facebook. I was already like I had a little following because I would sell boletos to all the events in Florida. Oh. Right, I worked with a lot of promoters and stuff. Right. And um, so I think that's how he had me on there. And then I was trying on to buy there, some tickets. No, he wasn't. On there, I would randomly post, like, follow me on Snapchat. 
So mm-hmm. I think that's how he added me on Snapchat. Mm-hmm. And then, yeah, he randomly sent me a message history. one day. and <laughs> yeah. it's, it's history from, from there. there. Yeah. History. So you found her on Facebook. Facebook. You were like, oh, she's cute. Let me follow her on Snapchat. Or? Yes. Yeah. But I, I started following you like. Way before. Way he, yeah, he, like are, he had a little girlfriend and he was over here adding oh, me. I was like, oh, yeah, even a message, hi, or something. That is so funny. It, no, but when I did the math after the fact, when I realized that he had messaged me before, I was like, Ooh. No, I think oh, that's uh, trifling. When I was single for a <laughs> week. So wow. <laughs> yeah. That's so funny. Yeah. So you just like slid in the DMs on Snapchat? Yeah. Literally. Uh, yeah. What caught my attention from him is that I'm sure you guys get it too. A lot of girls get all these messages from guys being like, ay, Random que bonita, ass. hermosa, you know, like all mm-hmm. that weird stuff. Um, <laughs> yeah. But him, I was on my way to a festival, so I was like all raped, you know, uh-huh. out. And um, he was like, oh, you're going to a festival. And I was like, yeah. So like small talk like that. And I'm like, are you going? And he was like, no, um, my family wasn't down. We're like Mexican, so they didn't really be into that. And I was like, it's a Mexican guy. and He's down to go. Like, that was news to me, especially uh-huh. in Florida, you know? Yeah. So, yeah, we just kept talking after that. You guys have, like, honey bells out there, right? We do. From what I've seen. Uh, maybe, like, once a month. Uh-huh. Once a month. It's not, like, yeah. over here that there's a every million weekend. every week. So, it's not, like, saturated with Mexicans. Oh, no, no, no. Not yeah, at all. No, especially no, Tampa. Wow. Which yeah. is a good thing, but a bad thing, too. Because, uh-huh. yeah. I mean, there's not so much opportunity to, like, grow. Okay. As far mm-hmm. as here in LA, you know? yeah, you can't oh, okay. you can't do a meet and greet. Out yeah, there the majority have... of my sales are for Guadis is um, Texas, Texas and Cali for sure. Top, yeah, oh, wow. I could see that for sure. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, I was gonna say, I know you had a chola phase, right? Oh yeah. I w- where did we hear this from? Was this I heard it on, podcast on the podcast with Graciela? And yeah. Raquel, right? Were you guys already dating in that phase? Oh no, no. no. This was like cuando I was like. 13, 14. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah. So funny. And I met him 10 years later, so he didn't she get to see that. that. <laughs> so, like, when you say, <laughs> when you say, like, a chola phase, like, were you, like, actually, like, a chola chola? Or was it just, mm, like, well, browse? Well, in, Me- in Tampa, wait, in Tampa, remember, there's not a lot of Mexicans to begin with. Uh-huh. At my school, total, we probably had, like, five Mexicans there. Oh, you know? shit. Yeah. Wow. Um, but the girls that were um, Mexican, um, they were cholillas, too, you know? But we weren't, like, let's say, um, <laughs> um, like, gang banging and stuff like that. <laughs> so no, it wasn't we on site. We were just, <laughs> oh, that, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. We no, love but, it. But we would wear, like, the dickies and, you know, the the tank tops, the belts, you know, the um, Cortez and stuff. And oh, then, um, and then in my little neighborhood, um, there was a few more Mexicans there. They were all Cholillos, too. So I kind of so grew funny. up seeing that. And then me knowing that I'm from Cali, like, me llamaba la atención, you know? Mm-hmm. So... Mm-hmm. All right, don't yeah, let like don't face. let her fool y'all. I'm, I'm gonna let spill the tea. Uh, spill he's the tea. always Go trying off. to put me Before out. Before y'all guess, how many tattoos does Lily Bay have? Guess. I literally just see like one. I don't here. even. And oh, I did. And I just see one. See it. One. What? Like, I didn't even two? know you two. Probably like four. I want to say like ten. I have, I have like 20. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> where? They're like everywhere. Random. Show us all. I was just like, okay. Ears. Wait, the big question is, where's the chola tattoo at? It's right here. <laughs> She's like on my ass. I was just like, what? <laughs> so it literally says girl. chola? Is this cholita? She's she screaming. Yeah. Did you have a nickname? That was my nickname. Oh, Cholita? Yeah, yeah. 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 So and like me. You hate when I call you Chola, right? Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> that is hilarious. I can't even picture he you as a Chola. Yeah, like, yeah. What? That's so funny. I'm right? always putting her out, my baby. <laughs> it's okay. Wait, I, I'm the one that said it on the, la- on the last part. No, no, no the, the tattoos. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, are the other care. like Are the other tattoos like uh, Cholita, re- like Chola related? Or, uh, or are they just kind of like... Uh, no, right? Uh, no, no. Oh, I do have. I do have. You have that one? I'm putting myself out. No, I I do I have that, only though. God can judge me. Yeah. Oh, okay, period. Yeah. I mean, period. I mean, L- facts. Girl. LA vibes. <laughs> oh my God. Do you I have tattoos? That. Not one. Oh my Not God. One. Yeah, because yeah, I was going to ask, I was like, are you a cholo too? <laughs> no. I'm, a cholo. I'm a good boy. I'm yeah. a good boy. I'm a ah, cholo, so I'm a cholo funny. phase. So, if you would have day. met her at her chola phase, um, would you like? Would you guys? Would you, would you, guys, like, <laughs> would you have like so. been with her at the chola I, face? I I always think no, but when he sees pictures of me, he's like, I would have hollered. I'm like, okay, period. <laughs> period. At that at that time, I also went through a little cholo phase, listening to SPM, Little Rock. But not really yeah, dressing you know, it, right? Not dressing. I mean, I had the dickies and I oh, had yeah? the, the the hair slicked back. Oh, he's like, right? I had the brows. Am yeah. I just, like, I'm just kidding? Well, his, the brows. Pa- his parents were super strict, yeah, right? Strict if they saw them. them yeah. Dressing up like cholos, she would be like, nope, you know? Yeah. And where my dad, um, my dad never cared 
um, like they would buy me the clothes and stuff, but he just didn't like me wearing the guy cholo shorts, oh, you know. Okay. But the pants he didn't mind, but the shorts uh-huh. he would be like, "Go change." I guess I don't know. He thought I was gonna like grow up and uh-huh. I don't know so go the funny. other way. Yeah, yeah. Well, your dad pretty much grew up here in L.A., right? In yeah, so- and my dad grew up um San Jose since he was little. So yeah, he. I don't think he had a cholo phase, but he definitely had a lot of cholo friends and oh, stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. So, so what town would you like rep? Like what was your town? Because um, <laughs> usually you, you have like West okay, yeah, so that yeah. was. Did you guys have like certain hands? Like, oh no, no, like, that no, no. I mean, she's like, she's like, she's like, oh, but that's not like a gang. But still, it's wet, that's where you're from. That's you know, the West yeah. Coast. You know, okay, yeah, yeah. Plain shit. Mm-hmm. I'm yeah. here for it. <laughs> Were you but, like a troublemaker? Yeah, I was yeah. so bad. You're a fighter. Girl. Yes, I was ah! so bad. I did. Well, the I I feel like it was more so because we were raised in an area where there's not a lot of Mexicans. So at school, they will like bully you for oh, being Mexican. Yeah. And yeah, like they'll so just, would get like, look, they'll like look down to you, you know? I think, um, I so think you were if, rocking, bitch. If she wasn't bitch, on, I was ready. <laughs> on social media or YouTube, like right now, or had that life, you'll still be about that I life. Don't, I don't think so. Like you'll no. snap off I was quick. gonna ask. You, 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 I'm here for it. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna ask, would it ever come out like now? Like if a bitch is trying you and you have to Honestly, I've been yes. put in situations <laughs> and I like held myself True. really, really good wow. um, oh, up until. Should, should we tell yeah. them about that? You we, know the fuck we, queen. Bitch, you're not ready she for this. I'm ready. I'm here. I'm, I'm here for it. No names. No names. Yo, no names. Uh, no names. No names. No so <laughs> we, we went to a baile. I took my little sister. Her first time when she was 14, we went to a Forza Regida concert, right? And. Um, so we're out there, we're vibing, you know, um, I feel somebody like shove into me and I look back and it was my little sister. Oh. And, uh, and then when I look at her, some grown lady, like in her forties is arguing with her, like in her face. <gasps> oh, hell oh, no. But That's I was crazy. like, so on cloud nine, you know, I'm like hippie vibes right now. Like, yo, peace <laughs> and love, you know, that I went up to her and I was like, yo, relax. She's only 14, you know, like just, you know, leave her alone. But the lady didn't care. The lady was like, I don't give a fuck. <gasps> like, going off. Oh, you know? damn, oh, man. So when that happened, back in the day, I would have popped off, you know. But I was like, no, Mando came. He's like, let's just walk up to the front. We were in the VIP area, so it wasn't like it was a million people. So we were able to walk up to the front. So when Mando moved us aside, when he, like, turned his back on the lady to walk away, the lady got mad. And I literally she, put my back in her face, like, yeah, you know, like yo, down. you know, yeah. she threw her drink at Mando. Oh, yeah. hey, and oh, then no. when Mando turned around, like, yo, what the hell? The lady swung on Mando. No, yes. oh, yeah. no. So I, she wanted trouble. Yes, yeah. she yes. Was looking for it. So when she swung it, right? on Mando, that's when I fucking lost it. That bro. was it. Yes, that, <laughs> that was, was on sight it. because, you know, like, bitch, I try to know. talk to you. Yeah, <laughs> and then because Mando's such a good guy, he would never like hurt even a fly. You know. <laughs> <laughs> so when people like get attitudes with Mando, that's yeah. when I'm like, bro, because he's okay, such a good guy, know. you know. But not only did she go off on my sister, she went off on me. She threw a drink on Mando, and then she swung, swung on Mando. So what you do, girl? What you do, girl? We went at it yeah. right there. Period. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this was already like my sister's already 18, so it was like four years ago. Right. Oh and there my was, god, her, her weave was on the all floor. over the floor. Yeah, it was bad. Yeah, I'm it was crazy. Dead. I guess the only win from that night is that I kicked her out and we stayed yeah, in the VIP, yeah. so it was good. Yeah. Because again, I sell boletos for all, oh for all these people, so I'm never in those type of situations like yeah. that. But. That day, and that's funny. the night that we met Jimmy Omilde. Oh my god, oh, we like no shook hands with him. They took us backstage. All my nails like, were broken. <laughs> yeah, that was all bleeding. Her hair was like this. Oh my god, yeah. no, that is but hilarious. But before that, I hadn't gotten in a fight since I was like in in high school and stuff. You know, like younger, younger. I mean, you had to do what you had to do. Yeah. Yeah. What would you do? I would have fucked the bitch up, I'm girl. Sorry. And at it's that point, yeah. yeah, that was like the turning point for us, though, right? Yeah, we came. We came to a realization, and this was again four years ago. Influencer life, we started like two years ago. Mm-hmm. But even then, people recognized us, so yeah. I was getting videos sent to me. No, yeah, yeah. Oh, the fighting getting, yeah. down, fight, yeah. yeah, like different. Somebody angles. sent me the video. Oh, that's like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, <laughs> let's post it right here. Like, what is going on? Oh, no, 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 I'm kidding. What I would pay it's, to see that video? It's, it's gonna right? come out at this point, it's gonna come Dude, out. Shut shut up. Up. Fuck, that is hilarious. So, we, we came to a realization, yo. As much as they tried Holy us, shit. we can't be doing At this. All. You have to walk away because if I was I mean, only an influencer, I think I'm a valiera madres and I'll still be mm-hmm. down if it ever came to that extent. Yeah. 
But since we have the brand, I'm like, we can't be getting off mm-hmm. this image, you know? So Especially, yeah. like, yeah, as content creators, like, we get, you know, hate all oh, the yeah, time and stuff. Oh, yeah, real quick, yeah. But, like, it. imagine for real, like, a hater really coming up to you like that and starting shit. Like, yeah. what do you even do? Because I thought about that. I'm yeah, like, well, we learned do? now, like, take a security. Like, it might sound so oh, dumb. Okay. It, you don't have to hire somebody, but, like, oh. a big friend, you know, that mm-hmm. doesn't drink and he'll look out for you. Just That's to, true. Just to that. move these girls away from you, if you it ever comes to that, you know, because that that was a big eye-opening ex- experience Yeah, because I've had people just walk up and bump into me for no reason. Yeah, like... Recently. Mm, yeah. yeah oh. like, what can I do? You Especially know? as a guy, like, yeah. and we are out there. We go to the bailes, jaripeos, all that. So they'll see, like, all these girls, like, taking pictures with us, you know. And, you know, like, in the Mexican community, a lot of guys, they're, like, very... How do I say it? Like, Machista. uh... Come on. Machista. Oh, yeah. Machista, yeah. So they'll just, like get mad i guess i don't know so they'll like try yeah. mando you know That's and like so mean bad. mugging him sizing him yeah yeah, oh my God. yeah. i mean they're drunk they're having a good time so and, they're like kind of yeah. hating so and like... luckily he's not um no se fija like he mm-hmm. just brushes it off because like so again, he's not really like a fighter no yeah. not at all yeah. he's such a good guy like uh-huh. he'd rather make friends with these guys like yo compa no pasa nada like you know, <laughs> let's have a drink you know yeah. um yeah Different. but mm-hmm. that's how it was hey, too that was, t- that was intense we went in oh my god <laughs> i'm here for it i, I for love it. that i love the tea i'm here i for feel it. like karina's very like that too yeah i feel like she's calmed down with like I, how you know with like youtube and everything you do kind of like think about it more like i can't be acting up and stuff yeah but karina was a crazy so bitch. i didn't have like a chola face but i did have the eyebrows but okay. I, I mean we like, had the eyebrows I, I think it was just because we had like i didn't like mouth. really like hang out with like any cholas i guess well our friend elizabeth like she kind of had a little era too she, kinda, she had a little era i looked scary but i was like <laughs> you couldn't fuck with her so like you she so was you were down they no, knew but like down. i definitely like i wouldn't dejarme like oh, yeah. i wouldn't like start issues but i've always like I would never let her. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was me. And then I was 100%. a little bitch. I was the one that was like in the fucking corner. Karina <laughs> was the one that was like, get in line, bitches. Like, very that no, energy. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, not really like that, but yeah. Girl, girl well, but in the I've locker always room. been more like a like, cabentada, I guess, than you. Yeah. But, so I mean. How many fights you've been in? You know what? Not even like that. Like, I've had like a lot of arguments oh, in okay, school, okay, like okay. a little pushing and shoving, but yeah. like fights, fights, like what, like one or two? Like, didn't we get in a fight at some Halloween party? You yeah, were in that fight yeah. too. Yeah, because we were drunk. <laughs> we were all in that fight. No, the bitch was trying all of us though. Oh, no, wait, she but deserved it. right? Wait, in school, no, the well, in you didn't school, get in a fight, but you, yeah, I mean, her bullies had came up to me and yeah. tried to like tell me. Oh, they shit, thought, and I, I think was they like, thought fuck you were you bitches. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, like, yeah. But after that, they didn't do anything after that. Period. But like, but I feel like you have that side of you that people don't know, bitch. Yeah, yeah. So I'm not like a crazy fighter, but like, no me dejo. Like, yeah. I will stand. I feel my like ground. you've changed a lot, like now. I'm very much like. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna give him my ass whoop probably but like it is what it is like yeah, yeah. I want to speak up you know what I mean yeah, yeah. yeah. so you're you're not like me we don't initiate fights or look for trouble yeah. at yeah. all but if it comes to us then yeah it's going down you know yeah. maybe so my no, cousin yeah. told her like you have to turn that lily bay switch on yeah. and off so when you're uh-huh. out in the public nothing to do pictures, with fighting yeah, it's, not, yeah 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 so like should I tell them too like for example when <laughs> <laughs> oh my god I'm here for all the fucking tea <laughs> no. people are gonna love no, it this is not that much um, people would have come up to us at the beginning of YouTube and everything, and yeah. I'm down. I'm, I live for these moments to take pictures with people <laughs> yeah. and everything. She'll be like trying to figure out who are you? Do yeah. I know? Oh, you? because at the beginning, mm-hmm. girls will come up to me and they'll be like, "Oh my god, hey, I'm the one that messaged you," you know. Mm-hmm. So and you got my head like working, like trying to figure out like, okay, what message was message? But it <laughs> yeah, was showing yeah, my yeah. face. I would be like trying to think about it until. Mando's like, hey, you know, even though I know you're not like a bitch or like yeah. trying to look mm-hmm. like one, like, you're you think, you're thinking, so you're like standing there, like, processing. yeah, I'm trying to process, and, like, because I really genuinely want to be like, oh yeah, I, I remember, remember the you. conversation. And you know? by that time, the girl that asked for a picture is like this bitch. No, no, nah, they never no, do I'm, that. She's probably thinking. Oh, that's you what know? you're doing. Like, <laughs> yeah, I guess, that, I you know? So now I know, as you guys may know, like you're not going to remember every message that you respond I mean, yeah, to or no, anything. For sure. But you don't want to make people feel bad or yeah. be like, no, no, I don't remember mm-hmm. or like which message because you're never going to remember. Oh, yeah. So now, you know, when people come up to me, like I just know, okay, you're my friend on social media yes. and let's get fucking lit today. Mm-hmm. You know, like, oh, hey, what's up? You know, right yeah. Away. instead of me switch. trying to process like, <laughs> What message? Okay, what did we talk about? And that's really... Because at the beginning, I wasn't used to people coming up to me and saying mm-hmm. hi. So whenever they asked me yeah. anything, I would be like trying to think, well, you know? I, I feel yeah. like I still do that sometimes. Um, sometimes I'll have people say like, I met you like 
this day yes, like six yes. years ago and i'm like oh my god like hey girl or like, when they know? say like i know you're from somewhere i'm like i don't like to immediately assume yeah. it's like i'll be like they're like you look familiar i'm like in school or like i try to like think Process. like what yeah. is it because i'm like yeah. okay what if it is like an old friend from school i'm over here like hey you know you yeah, too, you yeah. Know? yeah um but yeah i don't like to assume but yeah, yeah i'll just be like oh i'm on social media maybe that like yeah. we do youtube like yeah. you know <laughs> Oh, yeah, the initial first reaction from me was, like, confused, you know? So that's yeah. what I had to change. I get that. Like, just Do you guys happy, ever you know? overthink, like, oh, my God, how was it? Like, I don't know, because sometimes, like, if I meet somebody, I'm like, was I being too, like... Like, I'm Did always scared to come across, or, like, yeah, a bitch. Yeah. No, you no. You know what I mean? And you shouldn't, because at the end of the day, you know you're a good person. Period. And you don't mean no harm, you know? So... I'm yeah, no, I don't. I don't overthink Love about it. stuff like that. That's yeah. good. Love that. Well, so, I'm not an overthinker, so at all. <laughs> yeah, at yeah. All. I'm a fucking big overthinker. Yeah, me too. Me too. Oh, really? All my friends are believe it, believe, believe yeah. it or not. All my friends are, but yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I don't overthink that. Yeah. Okay, guys. So we're gonna do a little game. It's called. Oh, um, oh, I'm excited about this. who's most likely to Lily and Mando edition. Oh, my oh I love that. Okay. So who's most likely to black out? Oh. Mando. Me, me. Oh, yeah. I know this answer. Yeah, two days, <laughs> one night ago. I know this shit. You blacked out? I blacked out. They said we had we went to an apartment. That you, there don't was a bartender. you don't remember? You don't remember the apartment? You don't remember that, going to that the apartment? That there was pizza. He doesn't remember y'all there. That you guys were there. He's I, like, I don't remember seeing y'all bitches at all this last week. You know, just... uh, we made some TikToks too. Yeah. None of that. No fucking way. <laughs> yeah, you definitely blacked out. You were like on the couch, but it that's was funny. Sleeping, you don't remember. Yeah, yeah. What was the last part you remember of that day? Uh, le- not not even leaving um the party, not even leaving the party. I don't remember that. Oh, what? Um, shit! Nah. Oh my god! Everybody I remember a lot out. of people drink. Like a lot of people blacked out. I remember yeah. um somebody saying, "Hey man, you got to catch up on shots." So I took two shots and he took one. I think. And that's that was it. Oh my god! I remember. This was Beauty Bird's party, right? Yeah, yes. Party. I was yes. Like, Fuck everybody everybody got fucked shots. up that yeah. day. Everybody, super, think, super. Yeah. Hell yeah! People had yeah, it was fun. Out. It was fun. Oh my god! Everybody blacked. Okay, let me stop. Mm-hmm. Everybody blacked out. Have <laughs> you blacked out in the past? I'm sure, right? Yeah, the, last, last weekend week. at my Halloween party. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Oh, I, I thought I went up to bed like at one, and people were like, "No, we stayed up till six And I was like, "What? I don't remember." Yeah. Didn't you say that they like your friends already took you to bed? Oh yeah, yeah. They like carried me upstairs apparently yeah, yeah. i woke up and i thought mother was next to me no it was my homegirl sleeping next to me she woke up as carol g oh yeah <laughs> that was, that was my red fucking spray all over that. my white covers no! and shit yes it was bad oh my god my oh eyelash my up god. here yeah, that was, is so, you were bad bunny huh that was bad yeah. bunny oh my god let me artist. tell you guys right quick about that night um, I was Bad Bunny and I was on full Bad Bunny mode. Yeah, yeah giving a concert and shit. That he Every was bad single bunny. time um, somebody the DJ played a Bad Bunny song, I grabbed the mic and do the performance. Here for it. I'm, I was like, I was Bad Bunny on Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blacked I love out. That. Blacked out too, you know? That's so funny. <laughs> okay, so who's most likely to mess up an order? Mando. Mando. Like at Guadis. Mando. Yeah? Yeah, sure. yeah all day. I remember uh, when we used to ship orders, I would, oh my God, this sucks. When you ship a customer an order that's not theirs and then. Oh you ship my God. That yeah. one, We've so, done that shit. Yeah. So you have like a, a three way oh mess up. Oh my God, I hate that. Oh yeah. Like, yeah. So they have to like return it? Or? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I was like, no, what? Yeah. Keep, keep, keep it. Just yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah, that's what <laughs> we do. I'll send you your order. You know? I'm like, keep it and we'll send you a replacement, yeah. girl. Your right order. Yeah, yeah, yeah for that sure. That shit does happen for real. Yeah. yeah. And they'll email you like, hey, I got someone else's uh, order. I'm like, oh shit, they'll have like the, the same Fair first name, but like different last names. But Literally. It like, happens. I'm not a small, I'm a, I'm a 2X. I <laughs> like okay, I think I know this one. Um, who's most likely to start a fight? Black start? Fight. Start a fight, yeah. Mm-hmm. Or just get down in general. Yeah. What about like me, between me each sure. other? Oh, yeah, like relationship wise. Oh, Probably, more yeah, probably, yeah, yeah probably me. Sure. But we never really fight like that. But it'd be like little bickering shit, like, "Yo, why didn't you do this or something?" So me, he no ve nada. He don't see nothing wrong with nobody. So period. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> oh my god, I totally missed a question. It was oh, fuck. It's okay. We're it is what fun. it is. We're just gonna throw it in there. Right, right. Yeah, yeah. Um, I wanted to know your guys' most embarrassing drunk story. Oh yeah, I know. I have to uh, go back to the fucking questions start, okay. because you named it Grupo Firme um, concert, the YouTube uh-huh. video. Oh my god! If you god. go back and check it out, I blacked out. Um, 
the name Lorenzo came out after that. So every time I black out and wow. I get super drunk, they it's call Lorenzo. me Lorenzo. Yeah. Oh, That's shit. fucking hilarious. I swear to God, once again, thought I was Grupo Firme. I was crowd he was on surfing. stage and all. I'm I dead. was jumping the he fences. No, oh my God, crowd no. surfing. It, yeah. it, it, it was my first, first, first time that um, so many people recognized us. So many people. Oh so wow. I was feeling it. I, yeah. Everybody gave like, me shots. I am Edwin Casa. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, literally. I'm part of the band. Everyone that gave me a shot, I'll take a shot. Everyone's beers i was drinking like crazy blacked yeah. out the okay. worst part was that i had at the time i had my hair uh combed back and i don't know who who was throwing beer or whatnot and my hair was like a mess it was mm. it was a mess oh sound like god. a good yeah, fucking yeah. time is that video you watch for sure yeah. oh my god uh, what, what is mine do i have one <laughs> let's see let's see or like is there something embarrassing you do like do you cry or anything um like that? recently i've said this multiple Whiskey? times but i i stopped drinking bucanas yeah. you guys stopped. oh yeah yeah because um i'm a happy drunk like i'm uh-huh. lit you guys have seen me right i'm yeah. lit, just partying dancing you know whatever but um you have on those vests that i get uh lit with bucanas and I get like a little feisty. Yeah. Really? So, so a lot comes out. She's yeah. trying to fight. Yeah. yeah so so whenever the next day my friends would tell me, I would be like, "Bro, pero nada más me dicen dos veces," because I mean una vez because yeah. I just don't drink it no more at all. At all. What do you guys usually drink? Um. Well, usually I drink whatever. You know, <laughs> yeah. there was never a problem. <laughs> but yeah. Now I'm like, okay, bitch, you can't drink pucana, so I just don't. Just, I mean, oh, okay. I think you just get bossy, like. Like bossy, you put here for it. Yeah, that's something. what it is. Yeah, yeah super bossy. And I'm not like that. So. It's like you're cool as hell, but when you drink bucanas, it's like you, you think funny. you're the boss, but yeah. you're not the boss. <laughs> that is hilarious. Oh my God. But yeah, so funny. that was embarrassing. Super. Uh-huh. When my, okay. you know, the next day waking up and people telling me, I'm just like, fuck, I'm that's never going to do that again. I yeah. feel like mm-hmm. you're like so you though when you're drunk. Mm hmm. Like I feel like were, were you drunk this past week? Like, yeah, no, yeah. I feel like you're yourself. Like, you hold it together good. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, you couldn't tell that you would like. Okay. Yeah. Good. Good. Oh, my eyes do get a little low, right? I'd be like, mm, but yeah. right? Yeah. <laughs> my dad's always chill. like, "Open your eyes," and I'm like, "Okay." <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> All high as shit. I was gonna be like, "Hi." Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So oh. I guess we'll just jump back into the um what? Oh, you you were paying <laughs> yeah. Who's more? Because I had jumped back to the questions. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We're a mess. <laughs> Here's the next one. <clears throat> who's most likely to get arrested? Shoot. Me. Yeah, Lily. Yeah. yeah. Period. Have you guys yeah. ever been arrested? No. I'm like, I'm to this day. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> I have. I'm just kidding. <laughs> fucking oh, kidding. Never been arrested? Oh, no, no. Okay. I did yeah. 10 years in the pen. Nah. nah. <laughs> <laughs> These guys have, but yeah? Brian has. It's very, like, uh, it looks Jesus. Short, Wait, Brian? Brian Both of them are arrested. Both. What? Wait, Raul, yeah. too. Why? No, well, Raul was a DUI when he was, oh, like, yeah. 21, yeah, no? DUI, mm-hmm. 21. Yeah. I wow, got well. and can't go to Denny's in Vegas anymore. Uh, he got banned from Denny's, bitch. What? From Denny's in, in Vegas, Vegas. and he Denny's doesn't Denny's know what he did. I'm like, bye. And, like vandalizing stuff. And... Oh, no, you're like, probably fucking did. around. Just he, like, yeah. he swears he doesn't remember what he did, and, but I'm he got wrong. arrested. I'm like, bye. <laughs> he swears they did nothing. Like, we know you. You're crazy. You know this? <laughs> no. <laughs> anyway, no, but I feel like you and your friends are the madrosos, so I yeah. can see that. Yeah. That's like, crazy. Me and my friends, like me and my brother, you guys are crazy. That group, like, yeah, shit just goes down. Oh, I still damn. feel like y'all did trouble. Some shit, but in trouble, huh? Yeah, <laughs> but yeah, he was arrested for a couple days. A couple days, in yeah, Vegas. in Vegas. I was like, what the fuck? But I mean, <laughs> no, no pasa nada. I mean, I'm shook that when I was younger, I never did, you know, but because I was bad. Girl. You were bad, bad? Yeah, yeah. I was like, bad. Oh, I remember. Oh, my God. I'm Queen. exposing myself. Dude, you know, it's because I'm talking to you guys like no, we're not I'm on the right. podcast. You're like, Dude, cut the camera. I remember, this shit. I remember um, one time in middle school, we got in trouble because we were like throwing around um, like food fighting almost our Cuban sandwich stuff. And it landed on the... Um, on the band teacher's car oh my God. and somebody like snitched on us so what well, we which we didn't know obviously you know because uh-huh. we were just we were walking outside you know um so the next day uh they made us spray paint like work basically and mm. they made us spray paint all the band teachers um the stands because you know mm. people like draw on them and they're all fucked up oh, and okay. old yeah, they so they work. were like making us work in mm-hmm. front of everybody like spray painting oh them and the cop was standing right there watching us but that was when uh-huh. I was in middle school that's, that's so close funny. as it gets and you were a good kid <laughs> yeah I was a good yeah. kid 
on yeah, the road. That's crazy, huh? Complete opposite yeah. in that, right? Just night yeah. and day. Night yeah. and day, for sure. Mm-hmm. So he's always like, if we have kids, it's on this mother also. Yeah, you'll take that's all you. Like, that's all you. <laughs> that's all you, for sure. Dead. I don't want to deal with him. So Bad who's kids. most likely to get jealous? Who's a jealous one? Mm. I guess me. It's hard to tell. Right? You? No. I don't I, think I think so. you. Think me? You. Yeah, yeah. Are you like are you like the jealous type? I don't think so. That's what we kind of <laughs> You're like, hold on. Yeah, no, no not at all. I don't feel me. like um actually recently somebody messaged um one of my friends that we were with this past weekend and I was with her asking her, like, do you ever get jealous being around like so many girls that are pretty and like at all these events? Mm-hmm. Um but no, not at all. Like that's good. Like i I mean you guys have seen us at events, like he's over there, I'm over here, we're yeah. just like walking around, you know, vibing with it. everybody. So mm-hmm. Yeah, and I'd be vibing with everyone. The girls, mm-hmm. the guys. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. That's I why I say you guys are like social butterflies. Like yeah. sisters sometimes, yeah. you know? Like, <laughs> But we've never met anybody who has like cruzar that line. I get you know? it. Like everybody's yeah. been super cool with both of That's us. Good. But if they did... Oh yeah, if they did, I'll probably yeah. I don't down. know. I don't know what's going to go come out. You never know. <laughs> Cholita. Can you imagine? Cholita? Has She's anybody like, ever know. crossed y'all? Like, oh no, 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 no? nothing, nothing. Uh, or like flirting with like the in guys? the influencer world. No, no. okay. No. No. I feel like everybody's in a in a everybody's relationship very respectful almost. Too. Yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Like everybody has like their couple. I, I feel. think everybody literally does. Yeah. Influencer world. I don't think so. Yeah, yeah, no, it's true. I feel like I'm I'm very jealous. What? Well. Not like that. No, but like if someone is looking at you or, or it makes you feel uncomfortable, Brian will say something. No, one time it was, this was years ago when Hollister was popping. <laughs> <laughs> Hollister, right? Yeah. How you, I felt so fucking bad. It was this guy. Apparently he was looking at yeah, I didn't even fucking toxic realize, toxic. dude. But he's not even toxic like I that. Know. I don't get yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Um, this guy was, I guess, looking at me. I didn't even, I didn't even fucking notice him. And then out of nowhere, Brian pushes him against a fucking uh, rock. Dude, oh, I, and I was like, "What are you doing?" And then he told me later how he was looking at me, but I was thinking, "No, like, but you Brian didn't have said to like push he was him. like tragándote. He was like, it was, was making like, it obvious. What are oh you doing? yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the only experience, right? I think that's hilarious, right? Right, Karina, he's not toxic like that. Huh? I've never seen that. No, was the one time where I was like, that, Are you okay? I was like, What the fuck is going on? Yeah. <laughs> no, it, 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 like, I didn't even see it. No, it's because for me, it's like everybody looks or whatever, whatever, cool. Yeah, but you already got your eye candy. Look, look away. He was doing yeah. the most, so he was doing the most. And yeah, like, nah, he was asking for he, it. He's got to learn a lesson. That's yeah, I mean, bitch, I mean, and the guy was like all shy, scared. I was like, oh, <laughs> Well, I mean, Mando at the bailes. More recently, when the guys are like doing what he says, mm-hmm. Mando does kind of like get in front and like, you go, okay. you know, yeah, oh, okay, period, yeah, yeah. Because so that's totally relatable. Like, yeah, that's more in front of you, so yeah. Like, Sometimes I'm right, 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 right next to Mando, and they'll still come like trying uh-huh. to make me dance and stuff. And yeah, I'm well, like, shit. well, it, it was tough because I mean, I actually was recording at this yeah. time, and a guy asked Lily to dance, and mm-hmm. and she says no. She thought you thought it was a fan, like somebody. Yeah, took a first you, right? when they walk up to you, to you think that they're gonna say hi mm-hmm. or something. Not do you want to dance? You know. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh-huh. I'm like, oh mm-hmm. shit, this is my time to shine. So I take the camera. I had the camera rolling the whole time. I mean, I, I posted a TikTok, and um, the guy asked her to dance. I think I saw that. She says no or whatnot, and the guy is persistent. So I was like, all right, well, let me go. Yeah, he, yeah, you could. Yeah. So I went over there. I was like, hey man, uh, this is my girl. She's like. And he acted like like nothing. Right? He basically said, "I don't care. Yeah. I want. I, want no. I think I saw that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then, and how Mando, they, Mando's like, "How would you like it if we went up to your girl or something?" Oh, right, like, right. I don't know what he Dude, said. Some people uh-huh. are ballsy yeah. like yeah. that. I'm like what? So then, yeah. And, and then he, he was left. short. I'm yeah. like, <laughs> yeah. Mando's tall ass. Oh, oh my god, god. Uh, balls. Thank huh? God. Yeah. yeah, the comments on there were like, "Yo, short my king. man could never. My man would have been through down." It made a good TikTok. It was fun. That's funny. So I you're, know. I mean, you, you're you jealous when you have to be. I guess so. A little bit. So. That's not protect. even jealous. Though. I mean, that's it's like, not even, yeah, that's not even, you have to, I mean, yeah, it's you got to protect yeah, yeah, the, yeah. you know, respect, I guess. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Yeah. yeah. That was the only time that Brian shook me. I was like, what the fuck is going on? But yeah, I guess it's not like that either. I actually, I have a gift for y'all. <gasps> oh, oh my God. Oh, what babe, I it? forgot the damn gift in the kitchen. Oh, and I have to put it together right now. Me, right? I literally have to put it together. I'm crazy. Yeah, I have to put it together. Babe, can you put it together right, please? Yeah, thank you, Swish. Oh, what? Thank you guys for coming. Oh, as a, you know, what is it? Like as a... Uh, welcome? As no, wait. a courtesy okay. or... As a thank, thank you, you for coming on the podcast. Yay. Here you go. Oh, oh my everything, God. Uh, everything 
Okay, he's all about so the in there. Excited. Sorry, but what is it? What is it? Every time we try oh, to baby. order, oh, you're my. sold out. Your my little sister gonna is gonna die. Gonna I gonna had die. to, dude. Yes. I was like, I gotta give him some slime on it. That's just a little salsa, different. The concha. Yeah. yeah, that's the concha. I don't even want to mess these up. Like, oh, girl, it's fun. Like, it's fun yeah. to just like squish them and get them in I'm there. I'm excited. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Have you guys uh, tried the slime before? No, never. It's your first time. You, every time, like you always post, you know, three hours left, whatever the count, uh-huh. countdown, everything, and so I get on seconds. it. It's done. Oh, like, by the time we get on crazy. it. Yeah. That's I good. think it's, like, TikTok blowing it up again or yeah. something. Because, bitch, in, like, 2019, I yeah. was, like... Slime was a little dead girl. And then I don't know where, like, with a pandemic and, like, uh, TikTok it's and stuff. It's like, peak. It's at its and peak, I feel dude. like you doing them, like, different like this Wait, is, so like, iconic, you, you know? So you. let's go back to that. Is it huh? is it more popping now than when you first okay. started? Or? So slime videos in, like, 2017, they were more popping, like, on YouTube. Like, right now, yeah. I don't even post, like, slime videos like that. Mm-hmm. But the slime shop world, like, with businesses right now. Because, well, back mm. then I had my slime, but it was, like, the manufactured kind. Yeah, yeah. And right now, since we're doing it, like, handmade and stuff, yeah. like, it's, like, it's crazy right now. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah. yeah that's, that's dope. That's, that's dope. fucking crazy. I'm like, damn, We slime. saw you bought the big, the big old mixers and stuff. Yeah, yeah, we got the big too. mixers now. Yeah, girl, we're it's, trying to keep that's up. That's not here, is it? Oh, no, no that's no, at our warehouse. Like yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the haunted yeah. warehouse, apparently. The haunted <laughs> warehouse. I, everybody now thinks it's like haunted off. Yeah. Everyone tells me too. I'm waiting for my gift. Brian's taking a minute. No, no, y'all. you're good. Girl, I'm dead. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we have a gift too. Hell yeah. <laughs> so I know you told us you tried ordering. I don't know if you were no, able to yeah, get the collection. We, I had my sister order for us. Period. We here, yeah. So we actually made these yesterday <gasps> for you guys. Yesterday. No way. Yeah. Babe, did you put the labels on it? Wait, hold girl. on, because we really were making yeah. them like last minute, girl. And and I was telling her that this is such a cute and good idea. Like, so, so y'all gonna take oh, the collection nice. home, gorge, yes. nice. and it matches my aesthetic. Yeah, oh, I love clean. this. Oh. Merry Christmas. Yeah. And I did like why? Merry Christmas, clean. Yeah. That one's like sweet. Oh yeah, that's freaking you guys badass. Are smelling them, yeah. So- uh, yeah. so good I'm excited oh, it was thank you so, so much. great oh, having you, thank you guys thank you you guys too. were amazing yeah. our you. first like actual guest yeah like, yeah I feel honored guest. Yeah. I was like when you told me I was like no we literally, this we literally planned this so last minute huh yeah, yeah. we yeah. asked you guys at Big Bear at Big Bear yeah. right before we and left. we made it official like two days ago yeah you just have to switch your flight but I don't remember we switch our flight he's like I don't remember this funny because mm-hmm. you guys were supposed to be in Tampa now, right? Right now. Yeah, this is Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. Oh, so, oh, shit, yeah. Girl. But it always oh happens. God. Every time we come to LA, for sure, for sure, we're going to switch out. Yeah. happens. Which we don't mind at all. Like, that's what we're here for, you know, yeah. to hang I'm out. I'm glad we took advantage yeah. of the time. I'd yeah. rather c- stay here, you know, two extra days versus yeah. come back and plan it. Yeah, that whole let's, flight. Let's make yeah. it happen, you know? yeah. Do you guys come often? Yeah, like, we come, like, once to two times a month, for sure. I'm sure you guys are ready to go home, huh? Oh, yeah, I got to water my plants, girl. That's all I can think of right now. (laughs) You're like, (laughs) water plants. Oh, my God. Well, Well, it was great. Thank you guys for coming. Thank you guys for having us. Yeah. You guys guys were amazing. I love how you guys spilled all the tea. I love it. You guys make it so smooth. Like, we're chilling. It's like we're chilling on the sofa talking to you guys. Oh, my God. I'm here for it. I want to come on your podcast now. Let's do it. Yeah, down, though? You got to go out there. I will yeah. I'm down. down. I'm you know, dead ass. Mi casa, su casa. We'll show yeah. you guys around. Let's make it a trip. Let's do it. Let's, Let's, trip. Do, Let's it. Yeah. do it. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Okay, like, catch a safe flight there, leave Let's go. <laughs> Wait, I'm like, let me go pack my bag. Yeah. Uh, you know, yes. <laughs> but thank you guys for coming on. That wraps uh, up episode 35, y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know they're going to love this one. This is oh, okay. where could they find you guys? Your brand, um, your YouTube, all that good stuff. Our brand is at Guari's brand, G U A R Z brand. Yeah. Um, I am at Lily underscore underscore Bay. At Impromando, we also have YouTube, Lily and Bay. She also has her channel, Lily Bay, and um, the Kuru La Realidad podcast. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Period. Thank you guys so much. No, thank, thank you guys, guys for tuning guys. in. Yeah, and that wraps it up. Peace out, y'all. Bye. 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 <laughs>